okay so hello friends today our topic is the m protein so understand what is m protein so let's take this is the sorry this is the streptococcal bacterial cell wall okay so here fimbria are attached to the cell wall fimbria in fimbria there are sub proteins which are called m proteins okay and these structures are called fimbria now understand the pathogenesis that how they cause the disease so pathogenesis so what happened this is the bacterial cell and these are the fimbria which contain the m protein so they release those structures so release those structures okay now the this is this forms the soluble m protein Okay, in blood's blood okay so now the soluble m proteins will caught by two different types of cell first one is the monocyte okay macrophage or monocyte and next one is the neutrophil okay so how they got monocyte has tall like receptors so they will caught the m protein here and neutrophils they will form a fibrin network so suppose this is a fibrin network and this network has got the all the m protein now monocyte has also these are the tlr2 and also have the beta2 integrin here it is so now neutrophil will form a signal and <coughs> to the beta2 integrin now nanocyte or macrophage produce interleukin 1 beta interleukin 6 and tnf alpha so the immune response is now started so this is the pathogenesis of m protein so guys if you like this video then please do not forget to hit the like button and please do subscribe my channel